Hi, my name is Andrew Munson, and I'd like to welcome you to another Tech Talk by Frontier Precision. This video is part of a series of Tech Talks in which we will be covering the Kogo tools inside of Trimble Access. Kogo in Trimble Access stands for Coordinate Geometry. The Kogo tools are part of an included library of tools inside of Trimble Access. These tools can be used to perform a variety of calculations with your survey data. These calculations can be performed during your survey or when you are not in a survey as well. The Kogo library is located within General Survey in the top right corner. When you click on the tile, you will be able to see all of the tools that are available to you. In today's Tech Talk, we are going to be covering the Compute Inverse tool. Compute Inverse is one of the most commonly used tools and is very easy to use. It provides you with information to and from points in your survey. It provides information like azimuth, horizontal distance, change in elevation, slope distance, grade, and delta north and delta east. To use this tool, you will need some data in your project. My project here has a few points that have been measured using some GNSS gear. This can also be done with total station data. Open up the Kogo menu and select the Compute Inverse tool. Here, you can either select the points on the map or type in the numbers here. You will then be provided with two pages of information about your points. You now have the option of storing this result as a note within Trimble Access. If you do, you can go into your review job screen and recall the information that was just computed. This process can also be done from your map screen. First, open up the map. Then tap on the two points you want to compute the inverse between. Then, tap and hold on the screen until your shortcut menu comes up. Select Compute Inverse and you are done. The final trick with Compute Inverse is the Fast Fix option. If you are in a survey, you can compute the inverse between your current position and a point you have selected. To do this, open up the Compute Inverse tool again. Then, in either box, click the right arrow and select Fast Fix. This will take a quick measurement here to use in your calculation. Then, type in the other point name and you now have computed the inverse between your position and the point. In conclusion, we went over the Compute Inverse tool. This is an easy and helpful tool included in Trimble Access. There are many different ways that this can be done. This data can be stored and reviewed later in the Review Job screen. And that concludes our Tech Talk. We hope you found this beneficial and will join us again next time. Feel free to browse our collection of other helpful videos at FrontierPrecision.com.